If you had asked me as a little girl what I wanted to be when I grew up, I definitely would have said a wedding dress designer. Although hesitant about pursuing a career that seemed so sparkly and less formulaic, graduating from the design program at Cornell and running a New York high fashion sample room straight out of college, I quickly realized that design wasn't just a hobby, it was a way of life and what I was made to do. For me, the development of the dress is always the most engaging part because every single one is unique and leaves a different fingerprint on the brand itself. Sketching is a way to breathe first life into my designs, and from that point on, they have this identity. I like to think of my sketches as these little avatars that help me explore different realms of creativity and cater to various personalities and styles. This is also why I choose to name my dresses, because it personifies them. And frankly, it also helps me stay grounded during a process that's based on materials and aesthetics. It's a reminder of the girl, who she is and what she loves. Throughout the day, I work closely with my pattern makers and my sewing team. One of the hardest things about the design process, and frankly life in general, is recognizing whether it's time to give up or it's time to try harder. And sometimes you just need to run out of breath so that you can fully catch that second wind. Patience is super important. Whether you're being patient with a bride's decision, the people that are helping you execute an idea, or the making of the dress itself, it's important to keep a good attitude. I always remind myself that taking a couple steps back isn't the end of the world, it's more like a cha-cha. With each new season and every new collection, there's an opportunity for me to build a stronger vocabulary. In my mind, you can't use up creativity. So the more you exercise your skill set and push your mental boundaries, the stronger your interpretation will become. There is a wonderful sense of fairy tale in what I do. This industry has a ton of emotional value, and as the designer of the dress, getting it right requires a lot of creativity, but also a ton of compassion. I believe the best things in life aren't things, and getting to do what I do is definitely proof of that.